Hello everybody, welcome back. Dope and Rope here with some more Project Zomboid. Now it's been a few days in game since my last video, which you might not have even seen yet, depending on when it all gets uploaded, etc. But I've, as you can see, well you might be able to see, a couple of things have changed. Like I've got, got me a arcade machine, some more water butts. Um, do, do, do. There's quite a lot, to be honest. I'll go through it. I've made a hell of a lot more food. Well, I've made a lot of food, but I've also ate a lot of it because I've been doing so much. But I've organised some more of my stuff. So we've got all my like radio -y bits and bobs, in case you want to craft things. That's just general junk. Started to get some paint. Uh, got some like door hinges, but most of these are now empty, which means I've actually moved all the stuff to where it needs to go, so the foods are where it needs to be. All my like, extra magazines, extra bloody CDs and stuff, because until I can build the bigger bookshelves, you can only put so much in there, so it's just the overflow goes in there. Just the metal stuff, um, propane stuff and all that, etc. is in there. These ones are still a bit of a fucking mess, because there's just so much. And there's only so much time, obviously, I've put all my meds in there. Clothes are in there. I've grabbed the extra weapons lockers from over in the tent, the armory tent. And I've just started chucking. It's, it still needs a bit more organisation, but um, it's generally been brought over. Some more. I've cleared all of this out now, which is nice. So I'm going to probably use this for more storage. I might even end up with just more water storage in here or something. I don't know. But I've got this exercise machine. You can't use it by the looks of things. I don't know what the point in it is, other than decoration. You might be able to use it once you've got weights, but because I haven't got any weights, I can't even do any exercising with weights anyway. I've... well, enough time's passed for my carrots to grow, and they can be harvested, but I'm waiting until they are producing seeds. I've Harvest, harvested one just because I wanted to see how much um, experience I got towards my farming. So it's put it up to, I, oh, I think it's went up straight up to 26 because I think it was zero before. And that was just from harvesting the one, so that's good. So if I harvest all of those, it should pretty much put me as good as up to top of level two. But like I say, I want to wait till they're producing seeds. I used the mouse trap. It let me actually put it down. So I presume, if as long as I keep checking on it, I might catch something, like a mouse or something, or a rat, or I don't know. I've never did it before, so I don't know. But it'd be interesting to find out what that'll do. Um, just chucks a load of shit in here, some electronics I put just close to the generator. Which I've repaired, so he's, he's good to go now for a while. So that's been going on. I'm still waiting for obviously them to be seeding before I harvest them. But the big thing I've been doing is just putting more floor down. Which has took so long. If you remember what it was like, I think it was pretty much like that. And then I put all this down. So that took a hell of a lot of time just getting bloody trees and trees and trees. Because I've cleared all the trees in the immediate area here. And I've had to go down here, and I'm pretty sure I've cleared all of this now as well. So the next stop will be to go down to these ones. So I've cut down a hell of a lot of trees. It's been a bloody nightmare. But I need to do it. The longer, I mean, I, I should really carry on. Because the longer I leave it, the more shit starts growing. And it's you've got to then clear the stuff to be able to put the floors down. If you start getting trees and stuff like that grow. But um, in a way... It'd be good if they do get trees, because you at least should get some logs and you can use them straight away, but it just takes more time having to cut those down than do this, blah, 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 blah. So I thought I'd just try and get it done. So I've done some more, which is good. I have been eating more, and my weight is straight. It was going up yesterday, but obviously it's stopped going up now. But it was down to 68, and it's gone back up to 70, so that's good. I think it's because I started going down to eating a quarter once it was going up. Instead of eating half of the stew a day, I was eat, uh, instead of eating half of the stew at a time, I was going down to a quarter of the stew at a time. And I think I should have just kept doing the half. Uh, that's good, it's still going back up. But um, 
yeah, I think half a stew is probably best. I've organized it a little bit more so that I can stand here and access so I can make the stew and then any of like the condiments and all that stuff you can still it'll still say to add because you're close enough to it so that's that's a, that's a good thing at least my weight's going back up because he was starting to get annoyingly underweight but that took bloody time as well because I had to spend a whole day making it's pretty much a whole day making the stews, cooking the stews and bringing them back uh, because I've moved the barbecues from where they were on the wooden decking over into the the road bit just over here and it's surprising how difficult it was to get from here over to there with like nine full stews on me it took him bloody ages I didn't want to sprint in case I broke his bloody leg, so I ended up putting him over there, putting him cooking, and then drove a car back from there to there just to make it a little bit quicker. So yeah, I've got the barbecues over here just in case they catch on fire, and hopefully it won't, it shouldn't spread on the concrete. Whereas if it was on there, I'd be fucked if it was on there. And I've got my little container here full of bits and bobs I can burn for fuel. I've got some containers here which I've got all my car stuff in because as I was doing this I ran out of nails so I had to quickly dap over to here remember there's the I think it's that one it's like a mechanics place so I went over to there just in case there's any nails but I managed to find some nails in like a couple of these but while, while I was over there I thought fuck it I may as well grab that arcade machine and any of the car bits and bobs, which there was quite a lot of car stuff, which is good, so I brought it all back. I didn't know I was going to do it, it's only halfway through the day that I ran out of nails, I was like, shit. So it was, I would have recorded it, but it wouldn't much point, nothing really happened, just a couple of zombies, but nothing too adventurous. So that's done, so at least I got these, are now out of the way of this, so that's good. He's there, just these, he's the one I take to collect firewood. But yeah, so it's, it is getting there, it is getting there. It's just nice to have somewhere I can store the cars that's out of the way. So today I am going to go back over to here again because I want to grab a van. There's a van over here I want. But while I'm over there with the van, I want to collect as much of the scrap metal sheets as I can to help repair all the bits and bobs. Um, but while I'm also over there, I'll probably start burning down the buildings that I won't be using so just because I'm, I'm in my burn it down mood so everything I've cleared I'm just going to torch afterwards just for just for the lols so I've made a shit ton of mol molotovs so I've got 10 of they that should be enough to burn down a good chunk of the vehicle uh, vehicles the buildings over there I'll take some shotgun shells because you never know I'm still trying to do up my shooting skills so that I can start using pistols more efficiently. And obviously I think shotguns are pretty much the best way to go anyway, even even if you did have a high shooting skill. Um, shotguns are pretty badass in general, aren't they, let's be fair. It's so warm that I've took a lot of my clothes off, but it also makes me a bit nervous. So I might put them back on. I know it'll get hot, but I'd rather he sweats than dies. Not that it gives you much scratch proof resistance. I don't need the poncho. Don't need the welding mask really. I might stick on the leather jacket. He's gonna sweat like a bitch though if I do, but it's not a big deal. I'd rather be sweaty than dead, let's be fair. I should put some on his head, but... Oh, it's uncomfortably hot already. Yeah, so... Um, I, might, I might take the jacket off, I don't know. It seems stupid to... Guarantee the one time I go out there with no protection on my arms, I'll get scratched or bitten on my arms. Oh, and I wanted to 
put some signs up so I could write down like people who subscribe's names, but um, you can't actually write on them. All you can do is put like arrows or a skull and crossbones on them. So I was like, oh, that's fucking stupid. It should let you write what you want. So I'm going to try and figure out a way to put the names of anyone who subscribes somewhere. So I might just write, just write them. It's a shit way of doing it, but it lets me keep track of anyone who subscribes. So anyone who does, thank you very much. I will try to find a way of uh, mentioning you. I could just say your names, but I'm terrified I'll say your names wrong. So it might be better if I just write them down and play, hey, this dude, <laughs> this dude, rather than try and pronounce it and get it horribly wrong. But we shall see. I'll do something. Right, so... Double check I got everything before I go too far away. I did eat, so he's alright ish for the moment. Uh, I should. Oh, sorry guys, I'm gonna have to go back. Because I'm trying to keep it so he, um. So he is still gaining weight. Because I only ate a quarter, because all I had was left in that pot was a quarter. It's not doing as well as I want. Fuck's sake, alright. Oh, bloody warmth. Take this off for now. I'll put it in my bag in case. If I know I'm going to get into like combat with a lot of zombies, I might stick it on. When it's one or two, I should be all right. But it's the pure fact that that leather jacket before has saved me, you know. So it's like, ooh. but then that was down to my own stupidity, really. That's still frozen, unfortunately, but luckily I do have... Okay, it's melted, so that's annoying, but still. Oh, yeah, it's, it's really annoying, actually. Because now I've got to wait for it to unfreeze, or defrost, whatever you want to call it, to um, be good. Because if you eat it now, <coughs> it's more negative than it is positive but if you actually wait for it to unfreeze which will take a while it goes back up to being plus 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 uh, so I'll wait for that it's alright I don't need to eat right now as long as I have some food the main thing I want to do is get my ass over there get that van try and grab some metal sheets kill some more zombies burn some more buildings down pretty much I haven't bothered moving these because they're so far away. And I know it probably should. I should move that box at some point, but I like to live dangerously. <laughs> he says. I'll soon take that back as soon as my fucking car flips over. I probably shouldn't run, 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 but I could. Depends if these have any fuel. If they got fuel, then I could potentially take it over um, to the van and just dump it over there. me wasting all my energy. No, don't do that, you f idiot. I thought it would probably make more sense to check it's got fuel before I waste my time trying to hotwire it for nothing. I mean, that's, that's an option. I'll probably, because I do want to head back over to, there's like a brewery, if you remember correctly, where I got that truck which had all the bourbon in. And there's another truck over there, so I will need to drive a shitty car over there to switch the vehicles over. So I could always use those anyway, so it's not a total waste of time. This car looks like it's actually quite good, so I should just waste him. He's alright. He's alright. 
I might. Because I've got enough cars as it is anyway. And I do want that van, just because it's going to take a lot of storage to store all those metal sheets. Which I'm pretty sure there are quite a few over there. Alright, come on. Oh, it's just not my bloody day. I should have just bought a full can. But then it seems like a waste of time putting fucking fuel in it. Should be alright though. He says. I would kill him, but um, by the time I actually get over here, there is quite a lot of zombies. <coughs> quite a lot of zombies, so I'm going to have to run away from most of them anyway. Well, I don't have to. I probably will lead them away and then just shoot them, slash burn them. But it could go tits up for me. I'm not going to do like I did last time and run through a building being chased by a shit ton of burning zombies because that was rather stupid. <laughs> Follow me to your doom. Or to my doom. One or the other. Now, I don't remember which building it is that actually has most of the metal sheets in. So, I'm going to have to have a quick look through some of them. Christ, there's quite a few. Right, okay. Cut that to primary. Secondary. I know this one's an office building, so I'm going to probably burn this one down. So hopefully they'll start going through the building. Hopefully they might go around it. It makes more sense that they do, but I'd like to think they wouldn't. Maybe if I just throw it through the window? Oh, I don't like that. I don't know if that worked. I don't like throwing it inside the building though, it just seems fucking daft. But I might. Run, 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 run. shit! Oh, he was literally on fire for a second then. I think you can all tell how I'm going to die in this game. Stupidly, and on fire. Oh, you see, he actually is fucking doing it, so there. Oh, that was stupid. Yes, yeah, so that's it. You lot go in the building and spread the fire around. Right, so note to self, don't throw molotovs while you're inside the building. <sighs> okay, primary, what's this? 
kitchens. So he might actually have metal sheets in it, so I probably don't want to go in there. Which means fuck. Because they're going to probably set the fucking building on fire. It's not a big deal. It's not like I'm going to run out of metal sheets, because there's plenty of cars to dismantle. It's just, you know, they'd rather take them if, they're, if I can get to them. But at the same time, I really want to just burn everything down. Can I eat this now? I can. Okay, so let's eat this. Good, 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 good. Right, quit that primary. Quit that secondary. Hoping that did something. I'm hoping these will keep burning even though I go off screen. I think it doesn't, but I'd like to be proven wrong because I really hope it does just keep burning down. So this is going to be a radio place. I can't throw it inside because I will die like a bitch. What a stupid idea is me. No, that didn't work. God damn it. Why is it so hard to burn a fucking building now? I'm trying to think of alternate alternative ways of doing it. But other than like building a campfire maybe inside the building? But even that thing seemed like it was gonna probably work. Right. Maybe if I could lure them through the building. <laughs> like I said I shouldn't do. That might work. It might also not work. Proving really a, a lot harder to metal work, so ah, that's the one I want then. Um, burn these fucking buildings down that I was hoping for. In my mind, I just like pelt it with a fucking Molotov and just stand back and watch it burn, but it's actually uh, proving to be. <laughs> oh, stupid! So very stupid! <laughs> So fucking stupid. Cool, it fucking does it though, doesn't it? 
Oh shit, there's probably stuff in here I want. <laughs> A bit too late now, isn't it? Yeah, it's definitely too late to be worrying about shit in here. Oh, fucking box of screws, that'd be handy. Ah. Uh, uh, bugger. <laughs> probably shouldn't have did that one. Dang. Live and learn. <laughs> Alright, so hopefully he's burning. Hopefully he's burning. Yeah, he is burning. I can see it. Yes. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Right, so this one I think would be the dog's bollocks for finding metal sheets. Here's the van I want, so that's good. Hope to God I filled it up the other day. I can't remember. I did, so that is good. Right, good, okay. This place, I will have a look through. Burn this place down. Quit that secondary. Now I'd love to go in there and do it, but you know what happens when you do that. So let's try and get it through the window. Oh, get back. Oh, fucking look at that shit. It's like this game wants to kill you. <laughs> yeah, that's good. That should be all of that on fire now. Or not. say he is on fire now. Thankfully. Quit this for a second. I'm going to have to sit down and rest because he's getting a bit knackered, which is understandable. second and get his energy back. That wasn't me. Right, so he's still burning, that's good. Just want to quickly go see if the other ones are still burning. They should be. I'll be disappointed if they're not. See, he is, but why is this one not? This motherfucker should be well on fire. Well, that was disappointing. Why did the hell did that happen? Alright, we'll try it again. I'll try throwing it at the outside of the building, but I'm pretty sure that won't work. I get it, it's made of bricks, don't get me wrong, I understand that. But, I still feel like roof and stuff should burn. Like that one, for example. This motherfucker's going up a treat. 
but that's because I walked zombies through it and they were on fire. Which, don't get me wrong, it's a brilliant way of doing it, but oof. it's a sketchy way of doing it as well. Alright, I'm pretty sure this place has nothing of use left in it other than shit tons of zombies, I expect. some zombies over here and walk them through it on fire, possibly. Yeah, you'll do. You. Just need the one of you. However, setting him on fire might prove to be a bit of an issue. through it really so maybe I can get him to go through it. Oh no. There you go, shoot my gun. Hopefully he'll come through the front door. In theory. And I'm gonna fuck off out the back door. He just wanted to walk through the fire and then walk inside. So I hope he's gone inside. I don't know. He disappeared. that let track that guy to walk through the building but probably not knowing my luck right if anything I probably just attracted more zombies to come fucking get me here Right, 
Oh, it's too fucking far back. The idea is I can just take it straight from the building, uh, straight from the container into the back of the van. Set these fuckers on fire. In theory. And not die. In theory. And again, this place is still burning, so. Maybe I can. there and not wasting molotovs the sound of the gunshot, I hope. Which means... No. Heaven forbid. Come on, you fucking idiots. This has just been a fucking shit show. eventually. Oh, or not. That's good. Okay. Just want to get as many as I can.
fucking hear them somewhere. I'm hoping they're on the other side of a door, not in here with me. Because if they come from around there, it's going to be pretty... Or around the side of the van, it's going to be so quick that I ain't going to get a chance to f fucking react. Ton of them, so I'm going to get as many as I fucking can. Just being quiet because I'm trying to make sure nothing sneaks up on me. Right. Right. So, stick all of these in here. I'm gonna. Mm, I was gonna say, should I burn this place down? But this is probably the only one out of all the area. The buildings down here that I'm gonna actually want to come back to. Other than the one that I did slightly burn down earlier. <laughs> but at least only a couple of boxes went up. But what I really need is seeds. But a lot of it. I should be able to get seeds from the seeds I've already got once I start planting them. But it's been so long since I've uh, harvested any uh, like seeds for any other crops for seeds is knowing when to do it. It's been a long time since I did that. Normally I just take them straight out of the ground and eat them before they're starting to... I, th I believe you wait till they're seeding, it's called. Then you take them out. But, um, like I say, it's been so long since I did that. I'm a bit like, oh. Because if you leave them too long, I think they go bleh. They go bad, so... Just trying to find the sweet spot. for me. That's the sound they normally make when they're like coming after you. I'm hoping it's just the one that's on the other side of that door that I saw earlier. But he's making a hell of a racket. So we've got 44 in total. That should be enough for now, I'd say. I want to <coughs> I want to fast forward because it's my <laughs> my curse. But if I do, I'll die. Shut it. 
think the mill bloody the mill building would burn like a butte. You think? Oh, I should have did that. Taking stupid, unnecessary risks. Like running into zombies. It's just stupid. What's all this doing in the bloody building that prints newspapers? one. See if I can burn this fucker down. At least one of them walked through the fucking time. Burning zombie is. I'm hoping he's climbed into the building. Yes, good, <laughs> good. Yes, you will go inside. Ha ha ha. Good, good, and good. Pushing my luck, really. I'm hoping. Well, I know you. They'll keep burning, even though I've gone off screen. But like I say, I get the horrible feeling you go far enough away and then the fire just disappears. Oh, well, this one's still burning, so... Feels me with a bit of confidence that they will continue to burn down. Oh yeah, I'm still going. Well that was 
not as successful as I'd hoped for, but I did get what I went out to achieve, which was to get the van and the metal sheets. So I shouldn't complain too much. I'd have just liked to have seen the buildings burned a bit nicer. Cleaner, I don't know. Swiftier. <laughs> Is that even a word? Swiftier. <laughs> Swifter. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. there for now. Plenty of metal sheets, some more tires, which is good. It's good that I got the standard one. I think I got two standard ones. Or have I not? Oh, I hope I have. Heavy duty. Uh... really so I can fix up my trailer. No, that's a fucking annoyance. to be the standard ones. I don't think you can change it for like the sport tires. that, which I need to do at some point. Oop, yep, food. I need to do that, otherwise my... Yep, god damn it. That's because I only had the ice cream. Right, I just want to eat half. Then hopefully... might be because I've let him get too hungry because I got it going up before by basically every time that disappears I eat again so it's back to being full and it will start going up which I can do again it's not a big deal there will be a point when um like when it's raining season and all that I'll be in the base so much that you'll be able to keep on top of it I should take more food out with me, like crisps and stuff, and then as soon as it disappears, just keep eating. You just gotta keep eating. Which at the moment isn't too hard because all the, um, the food in the freezer is slowly starting to. very slowly, but slowly starting to go stale. So it just means you gotta start eating more. Like eating it, eating it, eating it. Yeah, the hams are gonna be the one that's gonna be like, oh. But, um, I'm pretty sure it has quite a good life on it, the ham. Still got two more to do. I've got a load of shit in here. I've Some of it st still should have a good bit of life, but I have noticed a few of them have started going stale, which are the ones I've used in the previous lot of cooking. Seems pointless taking that out at the moment because it's far too hot. So I'll put that back. So my next mission will be 
to head back up to these ones. Pretty sure it's like that one, I think, is the brewery, which is where I want to go to get the truck. And I'd like to think there's either a shit ton of beer or bourbon in there. So either or or both. And then I'll grab the, because I can make more Molotovs. I wouldn't mind setting these buggers on fire as well. Now that they've been done. I should... Nope. Uh, here we go. Add that. I can't fucking see it. It's so annoying. It, there we go. So I think that one... Uh, shit. I don't remember. It was that one. I think... And a couple, I'm going to have to do it again, because I can barely remember. I think it was that one. But I don't know for sure. But yeah, I'm going to have to try and figure out a way to burn them down without actually throwing Molotovs. So whether or not I try the idea of building a campfire, putting the campfire inside the building, light in the campfire. So I'd have thought that would burn a fucking building down. In my mind that would burn a building down. So I could try doing that, but I don't remember how you make campfire kits. I think it's with planks. Let's have a look. Because luckily I got a few planks left. Campfire kit, that's good. So it takes Ah, twigs and stuff. Right, so because I have some twigs, I can make one. That is good. Okay. Let's make one for now, just in case it doesn't work. I think it should work. In my mind, it feels like it'll work. try that at some point. I don't know when I'll try it, but I will try it at some point. It seems like a plausible thing to do, like that would happen if I actually stick it inside a building. Yeah. Um, okay, I might quickly Try and repair this. So what do I need? I need two tires, obviously. New suspension and a metal sheet. So I got the metal sheet, which is good. Grab one of them. Sorry, I want to lose. Just grab it. And one of those. The two suspensions. I think I got some suspensions. Regular suspension, yeah. Performance suspension. Does it matter what suspension you use? I wouldn't have thought it would, but what do I know? Good, good, good. Performance, okay. And performance, okay. So maybe it has to have performance. I'll have to take the wheels off first to find out. Okay. Um. Oh, I'm going to need the bloody... I think you'll need a 
jack, I think. And a lug wrench. That's those two. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. Just stick them on the floor for now. Um. Da, 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 da. Fucking grab a jack, keep bloody forgetting what you do and you don't need. if it breaks because it's not like I'm going to fucking use it again. I don't think you can repair them. No. Unless maybe you can once you're higher in mechanic skill, but I don't think so. Right. Let's test whether or not... Oh god, he's knackered. Uh, I can use a standard suspension. Oh, you can, that's good. Thank God for that. Did that damage it? I don't know. No. I don't think so. I hope not. I think it only damages it when you're trying to take it off more than when you're trying to put it on. Yeah, that's good. Thank God for that. <laughs> yes, install, for fuck's sake. Regular tire type 
heavy duty. Do you think? Where would I type the heavy? Because a regular tire, just heavy duty, I presume, just means it'll last longer. More than, because I think these ones use like heavy duty wheels. But <laughs> I'm not sure. There's, geez, we'll soon find out. Oh my god, did I not take a lug wrench? For fuck's sake. There you go, it has to be performance type. Any type as long as it's standard, okay. <clears throat> so the heavy duty ones are purely for trucks. Okay, so the heavy duty, heavy duty, what are you all fucking heavy duty for? vehicles. I think most of them are fucked though. That's why I parked them over here. As long as I can get at least one tire off of each of them. Uh, right. What's that? Regular tire. They're in by the time I take them off. That's good. That's good, okay. Sport, you fucking joking. Just put them on the floor for now. Piss take. I bet it even said what they were, and I just didn't fucking see it. See, that is of no fucking help. Part info, oh, there you go. Nope. It's of no help either. What is it? Standard, yeah, okay. Finally, yeah. Right. Discomfort, yeah, that's because you're gonna break your fucking legs. Dun -dun -dun. Vehicle mechanics. Store. Again, as well, just to get up a little bit more. I know normally it's like diminishing returns, but I don't know if that applies to things like trailers. I know it does to like weapons and stuff, but I don't know if it does with cars, like with your vehicles. So I could put that in the container. Put that in the container. Yeah, I, 
doesn't give you as much, but um, 75 percent is alright. Can't really complain. Right, so at least that is repaired. Uh, at least as much as I can for the moment. I mean, I could keep doing it until it goes up 100%, but I don't know. I, sh I don't think it will, like, eventually you'll do it so many times that you just can't repair it anymore. I don't think that works with, um, happens with vehicles. Obviously, it'll, you'll probably repair it more and better as my... Maintenance skill goes up, but I don't know. But anyway, way has yes, done, which is good. I can now reuse it. And well, hang on, let me just double check the tire pressure. That might be the only thing I need to do, but it's not the biggest deal. Yeah, yeah they're all right. That's good. So yeah, that's good. Trailer is back up to eighty-nine percent. Perfect. This thing's pretty good, so that's good. Eventually I'll dispose of this shit. I might store it somewhere for now, just in case you can actually repair them once you get to a high enough maintenance or mechanics or metalwork skill. So I'll probably stick them somewhere. I've got plenty of boxes in the base, I can put them for now. Just in case. I don't think you can, but maybe. Um, yeah, so let me go chuck my shit away, so I'm a bit less overweight and stuff. Chuck that away, chuck that away, put that back in there, shotgun shells, which is fine, crowbar, blah blah blah. Yeah, I'm going to have to start... Two of them are empty now. Not that I'm, I'm low on water, God, but eventually I'll start boiling up some water to refill them. Right, let's eat the rest of that. Out of the out of the rhythm he was in, where he was eating enough. But that's what happens because I went off. <clears throat> Whereas before, I was so close to my base. As soon as he ran out, I managed to get back here in time. But it's not a big deal. If I did it before, he'll be able to do it again. I've just got to keep on top of him eating. Ridiculous tire, blah, 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 blah. Skills. I don't think there's any more books because I read the next cooking book and that took bloody ages. Carpentry is going up. It's gone up quite a lot and that's just from putting the fucking floors down. Quickly check that trap. I doubt if it's done anything. Understand. I presume it just means I will eventually catch something, I guess. I've never used it before, the mouse trap. I just thought they were I presume the mouse trap would be you use it in crafting for some like trigger mechanism for like an explosive or something, but apparently you can actually put them down, so there must be a reason for it. Let's have a quick look and see if it's Flourishing. It's hard to tell because I'm such low level with my farming. You don't get much information as you get higher with your farming. You get a lot more information come up, so it make it a lot easier to tell when it's, I presume, seeding. At the moment, I'm just gonna have to guess. <laughs> Generator's fine, so that's good.
Right, that is pretty much everything I can do for the moment. He's so knackered. I'm going to have to pretty much call it for the day. So yeah, like I say, tomorrow, or the next video, I will head back up here. Burn these down, well, you know, as well as I can. I might try dapping here just to see if they're still burning, but then swing back out, drive up. I probably just drive straight up there, get the sort the booze and the truck out. Um, and then sort it out. Maybe, well, it depends. It depends what it's like up there. Because I still need to check these buildings out anyway. But basically, I'm going to go out with Molotovs in case I get a chance to burn them down. I'll take a crappy car because I'm going to have to switch the car for the, the good truck. Um, oh yeah, I've took most of the wheels off the fucking car. <laughs> there is still one car that's got some wheels, so I can use that one. Yeah, so that's the plan. That'd be the plan. I just want to make sure these things are still burning down. Which I think they will be, but mm, I don't know. I part of me thinks the fire will just go out as soon as you go off screen long enough. But I don't know for sure. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. Sorry it was a bit... wasn't as, wasn't as f flamey as I'd like it to have been, but still, there was some fire, so that's always good to see. Anyway, you'll take your study and I'll see you next time. Cheers, Gideon.